Welcome to season four of the vlog. Isn't it crazy that we're here right now? Welcome back, everyone. Don't trust me. I see you're still doing your little vlogging thing. That's really cute. Welcome back to the vlog everyone. I am here at the World Series. I'm sitting up in the terrace level at Minute Maid Park in Houston. And I came up here for two reasons. The one one was the main was the main reason to shoot scenics. And two, just to show y'all the, the, the amount of media at the World Series is crazy. And that's also why I'm not like vlogging down there because there's a lot of eyes on me. There's just a lot of people around. But like, look at the amount of media over there. It's crazy. I think Philly's gonna be a little bit of the same. But anyway, just to give you guys an update, I haven't vlogged much just because we've been working and trying to get a lot of work things sorted out. We did arrivals this morning, which was a lot of setup, and we did a photo shoot last night, or yesterday, sorry, throughout the whole day, and it was really cool. Uh, I did some behind the scenes stuff, so be on the lookout for like a TikTok of that. Other than that, like, it's been pretty easy work week. I mean, it's been long days, but like, really easy to get excited for the World Series. So I hope you guys do enjoy this vlog, and if you haven't already, please like and subscribe. And yeah, just, just come along for the ride, and I hope you enjoy it. Came down to the tunnel to upload the scenics, but while I'm doing this, I want to introduce you guys to two people. And both of y'all, I want you to explain what you do for MLB, just to give the audience kind of like an idea, okay? My name's Gabby, I'm a coordinator of our live content team here at MLB. So basically what I do is, I was at LCC for the past two and a half years in New York, covering the Yankees and Mets, now I'm helping us assistant and managing over 60 people on our team. What's up? I do everything she does, but worse. Uh, <laughs> I, I'm just a shooter, so I'll, I'll, I'll get photo, video, and for the playoffs I'm gonna roam around a lot, uh, probably sit in the Crawford boxes and see what I can get to do. Word. Give me some. Yo, yo, Brett, what's going on? Say hi to the vlog, dog. Going on your personal vlog? Yeah, man. Wow, this is an honor to be on PG-13's vlog. Shout out to his girlfriend, he loves you a lot. He posts about it all the time. <laughs> Dude, thanks, man. You're a simp nation. <laughs> of the game. The Phillies won 6-5 to five in extra innings. This was a really, really long day for me. As I've said before, a lot of these days are long. Uh, I didn't really get a chance to explain this before the game because I was busy and running around and the concourses were, were absolutely jammed. But this is where I shot from. Right here. Cannon 600 on the monopod and then I also have 200-400 in there. Uh, a pretty cool vantage point. Um, got a good shot of Kyle Tucker's home run. Got uh, some other good stuff too. It's a really cool vantage point out here. Um, I switched halfway through to the two to four just to mix it up and get a little wider. Always important, vary your focal lengths up. I've talked about that before, but um, I'm gonna go find my colleagues because I'm tired and uh, it's time to go. The team split games one and two. So it's off to Philadelphia for games three through five. Before I go back to the vlog, enjoy this clip of this guy getting kicked off the flight. No, 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 let me, let me finish the elevated up to the captain. Okay. And you said, if I came back here, you still on the phone and you on your move. I know you off right now, but they said it three times, you didn't comply, okay? She never said anything. You can ask anybody next to me. All right. You have to bring a black man. Okay. Yeah, go right here, y'all just playing now. Uh, guys, just go back there. Uh, Rick Rico's already on the way. You should never take that comment. So I'm not going to get home? And we're here in Philly. I'm running on like three hours of sleep. Four hours of sleep plus like 45 minutes in the plane, the second plane. Long journey though. Room tour time, you guys know how it goes. Um, 
Just FYI, this room feels uh, a little bit like a hospital room, in all honesty, which is pretty appropriate because uh, I could use a hospital right now. Bathroom, um, pretty bare, barren, yep. Um, there's a kitchen, a f***ing dishwasher. Like, I guess there's dishes somewhere in here. Yeah, this is a whole, whole ass kitchen. Interesting. And the bed. So it's like, I guess, a studio apartment. View out here. There's gray Philadelphia buildings. Not much to see in, in, in this hotel room. It's not very homey at all. It is game three. Yesterday was rained out and I'm outside and it's beautiful. It's fall, the wind's blowing, it's like 70 degrees. We're getting some exteriors and doing some fan stuff. Look how tired I look. That's that's just a physical exhaustion right there. I got wood grain in my dummy up. Oh. Cool quarter mill in my go yard dump. Yeah. I win the game, so you still got a shuffle. Bone with the drip and just learn how to hustle. Campbell, you want to explain what we're doing right now and why? Yeah, so we are currently setting up what it's gonna look like when I do the green man run out. Just trying to figure out the stabilization. I've never put an iPhone on my camera like this before. So basically, we're gonna try to get like my point of view, like me running. And then also, like obviously, this is gonna be shooting Kyle Schwarber, and we're just trying to figure out stabilization and how it's gonna look logistically. Hey, yo! Without context, this is so cool. I can't believe this is actually happening. Um, it's gonna be awesome. Man. So just to keep this vlog short, I didn't vlog as much the last couple games. It gets a little repetitive, you know. You guys know how games work. It's behind the scenes of the World Series. I hope you guys were able to get some value out of this. And I just want to thank you for the entire season. You know, it's been a long season. I've done a lot of vlogs. And I appreciate that. And, and um, I hope you guys liked me going behind the scenes of the Braves games, the playoffs, and then also the World Series. So here's my closeout. Just like that, 2022 season is over. Uh, it's kind of hard to believe, honestly. Um, the Astros won it in six, which was my original prediction. Did an entertaining series. Didn't really vlog last couple days, last couple games. Just because, oh, here comes the visitor. Joe, I'm closing it out. Yeah, I ain't got nothing to say. Joe, how would you think I did uh, this year? First year as a content producer. It's not about how you do it, it's really about how you put your mindset and attitude. And definitely appreciate Pete for really putting his hard work in. Always positive energy and some always energy too. Oh my yeah. god! Yeah. <laughs> but the season's over. I'm very tired.